Hey guys, and welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Last time, after being ambushed on the old Kana battlefield, can you, you always, you always do this, Senna, every episode! I'm trying to do the intro! Thank you. We had flashbacks that, yeah, Uni may have been a soldier in a gold colony in a different life. It's terrifying. That revelation leads to so many questions. I have so many epping theories. Is the Noah here? You know, our Noah? Is he the first one? Because we know that kid in the opening movie, bro. Is he just, you know, some dead kid being reincarnated over and over again? I don't know, but that is crazy. And I've not stopped thinking about it. The main story is great. But sadly, I'm a turd. In this episode, guys... <laughs> I gotta do some side quests, man. These are stacking up, and truth be told, I do want to see what they're all about. I will be abridging some of the less desirable ones, but first and foremost, where the heart is. Returning to Colony 9, that is just too good of an opportunity to pass up. So, I made my mind up, that's where we're going next. Additionally, we do have Big Friendly Friend to investigate all the way back in Colony 30. And there are some outliers that, yeah, I just either haven't found yet or want to do. In case the quest is super effing boring, I will be summarizing it in post so we can get back to the main scenario. So, let's hop to it, shall we? Only issue is, uh, how do we get back to the colony? Like, colony third, like, bro, we, we, we moving. We are moving, bro. God dang, and can you, whoa, you can skip travel to named enemies? That's crazy, bro, but yeah. I am now playing on the latest update of Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Apparently, the day one edition, uh, yeah, food just did not work, bro. So, you, you'd gather all these materials to make food buffs and. Holographic meatloaf? My favorite! <laughs> Crazy. I guess that's fixed, though. I kind of feel for, like, Monolith Saw. I know it's, like, kind of silly, like, just. They gotta feel so effing embarrassed. They push out their big, dare I say, monolithic game. And it has just one like glaring glitch. And they're like, ah, oh, crud. Like somebody's getting reprimanded, bro. I feel for that guy. But yeah, in between episodes, guys, you, you everybody's been leaving me like super solid like advice on team compositions and like stuff like that. And to you guys who are just going out of your way to not spoil the game for me, man, I, I, I feel the love, dude. <laughs> like really, but uh, some things I don't know if I can necessarily, like, uh, act upon. People are mentioning, like, a different style of Ouroboros, like, control. And, dude, I sat through the menus. I could not find crap. But, uh, stuff like, yeah, maybe making your, uh, tanks not, uh, the same character, at least of the Ouroboros, that's, that's a good tip. I'll, uh, I'll act on that in the future. But, uh, oh, dang. Hey, can you not? Bro! Oh, Oh yeah, got they kind of hate our guts. Well coordinated. Who's this guy? Oh, oh god, him. Hey, it's you. Oh no. I forget your name, but yeah, it's uh, that dude. Whoa. Fuck's sake, Zion. He's taking him on six on one. <laughs> and apparently doing a really good job. That looked like a really weak hit. You lose yourself to emotion. Some special forces you are. Are you calling me dramatic? Shut your trap. What a joke. Now, not everyone can be a stoic, okay? You consider me the joke, do you? Really now? Hey, isn't he? Yeah. He's our friend. From Colony 9. That's where you're wrong. You're traitors. You're no friends of mine. Oh my god. Zeon, just listen. We don't want to drop it, you. Negotiation doesn't appear to be on the table. We straight up gotta kill him? Oh, come on. Mimi. <laughs> we anime grunted and simultaneously. Arrest the turncoats. <laughs> like we're not all... Okay, okay. So we have to fight. We'll just go gentle. If he can take... Uh, whatever. We, get, we got this. Oh, no. They're actually kind of matching our strength. Okay. Uh, That should not be... Uh, uni here. I've also just been playing the game a lot. What the heck are you doing? I've been playing the game a lot more and realizing that, yeah, if you're not on the attacking role, the AI, maybe it's just me. They do not perform the best. This is I don't even know what's happening. 
And I play this game all the goddamn time, but at least when I was watching some of my footage, they were missing uh, more than a fair share of positionals. I'm like, what? You really couldn't? I don't know what the AI is prioritizing is what I'm getting at here. Poor enemies here. We got Fox. Okay. Dutiful Zeon and roll it. So they all have names. So if you're like me and you just sat there in the first zone and trying to like be all their friends, this this extra sucks for you. I'll say this though. God dang, Zeon. Yeah, you're the last man standing, but you're not doing a lot of damage. He kind of just sits here and and dies really, really slowly. To the point where he's annoying. That's, that's, I mean, what else could you ask for a tank? I don't know. He's doing his job, but <laughs> I don't like it. Now that we've slapped you around for 35 minutes, will you please hear us out? Seriously. Oh, they all just get up. Okay. Commander, please respond. What's wrong? <laughs> What's wrong with you? Come on, we're just getting warmed up. What? Come on, I mean, another 35 minutes. That's a, I'm wearing them down. Enemy attack. Agni of forces. Wonder what's going on. <sighs> Commander? Yes. I'm thinking. Hey, what did you just say? Zeon's the commander now. Wait, he got promoted? Does that mean the old one... Oh, no. There was a change of command. Someone had to take the fall for the traitors. Oh my god. He lost his rank because of us? They even dropped our colony rank. No, everyone took... Oh. We've been so pressed for food, we had to venture out this far. All because of you. Yo, my bad, but you don't understand. Wow. Crap. Uh, uh, it was either that or, you know... Go back. We'll take care of things here. I can't allow that. Just get going already. The Agnian Battalion. They're using terrain to cover their approach, am I right? How do you know that? I'm well aware that you don't trust me, I'm just speaking aloud here. We'll intercept the enemy troops, engage them while they're still advancing. They won't get their hands on the colony. You retreat and shore up your defenses. What are you really after here? Why is it you're fighting? We're both in very different positions now. But that doesn't have to mean everything's changed between us. Oh my god. What a man. Holy crap. Oh, well done. A voice of reason. Come <laughs> off it. Hey, hey. I'm literally telling you to run away. I'm not asking. I'm literally asking for nothing. Wait. Change of plans. We're bringing them back to the colony. A what? What? Uh, Why? <laughs> okay. You're handing them into the console. Oh, no. No. I'm integrating them into our force as the vanguard. Uh, okay. We're fighting with them. Mwamba died because of them. We're up against a whole battalion. Hardly the time for us to be picky. It's also possible that Ouroboros have instigated this attack themselves. Ugh, you can't be serious. Dude, he, his motives are all over. I mean... <sighs> you know exactly how serious I am. When, when things are this dire, I guess, yeah. Fire and sparks. Hold up. Let's do as he says. What? Why should we? Just play along. We'll be better able to help protect Colony 9 if we're part of the plan. Oh yeah, good point. I mean... At the same time, though, watch your back. Valdi's just sitting here, bro, like... <laughs> this is a bit awkward for me. I'm not Ouroboros, just... Uh, anyway, don't look at me. <laughs> Are they always gonna appear in cutscene? Plans? <laughs> if you say so. You have good friends. One day I'm gonna crack that thick bonce of yours and really see what makes you tick. I look forward to it. <laughs> I've also wanted to see what's inside my own skull. Bit curious. You lot head back and update Kite on the situation. I'll see to these ones. Meet me in command. As you say. <sighs> Man. These negotiations are all over the place. You said not everything's changed between us. Your words no longer have merit. So let's judge where your allegiance lies by way of your actions. I understand. We won't let you down. Z okay. He joined our party. I kind of figured he's the 
hero quest for this. <laughs> yeah, look on the bright side. Oh my gosh, we got a new buddy. He's so cool and reliable and not at all. You can't blame him. Oh, come on. And he won't. We got Zeon on our party. You can't, you can't let me skip traveling. Uh, whatever. Oh, wow. There's like debris and stuff that was never here before. Oh, hey, Zeon is here. Look at him. This outfit's kind of... Uh, it's different. He's got really tiny wings. I kind of like it, though. It reminds me of, uh, you know, the wings on Hermes' sandals. You know what I'm talking about. His whole, like, sword and shield motif also. I don't know. I like it. But his attitude, though. I don't know. I get where he's coming from. I'm sure he'll warm up. I wonder if, like, these hero quests are the only time they become relevant. I hope that's not the case, because truth be told, I, w I want to see more of, you know, Valdi and, uh... Things with Ethel might be kind of hard. How's the supervising going, Mr. Commander, sir? Five by five? Yes, thank you. Now zip your mouth and let's move. Ooh, he's hard to impress. Oh, man, yeah, their clock. Oh, God, you can see it in real time. Don't, bro, that stings. At first, I was like, ugh, why? Why would you introduce such a restrictive mechanic? And now I'm just realizing, wow, it's like actually... It's there to make you feel like crap for like story reasons. I wonder how people in the colony will react to us. Hey, can, can we still buy stuff? Remember me? Thanks guys, if you need anything, holler at me. Okay. I guess Gil is Gil no matter where you go. Well, good to see you all again. I'm impressed. You didn't run away this time. Uh. I'll explain what comes next. The rest of you are dismissed. Stay cool, Kite. I'm always cool. Clearly. Jeez. Tell us about Agnes's movements. Right now, they're assembling their forces on Everblight Plain. They've stopped concealing themselves, which feels like cause for concern enough. They're confident they have the numbers for a full assault, then. Or perhaps it's a feint. Or they're just a bunch of dolts who like pretending they have a plan. <laughs> Uh, ha, ha, ha. I'm not in the mood for jokes right now. Me either. This is horrible. Hey, we need a little levity sometimes. <laughs> not now. With enough food, we can draw this out. Give the word and we can even launch a raid. I told you, that's not going to happen. It would cost us too many lives. Dude, Kite does not seem like he's the commanding type. I don't know. What then? Our troops are hungry, anxious, and quite frankly, more pissed off by the hour. And they're getting no supplies from the castle because of us. Dude, th yeah, this... This is awful. Then, I don't know. Maybe we just talk to the Agnians? You leave things like this, and we're going to fall apart by ourselves. We could just remove their reason for fighting you. What? The clock. In plain language, please. If we smashed your flame clock, it would alter the equation. If you smashed it? Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> well, now I know you're all jokers. Nah, dude, this is real. Kite, biggest joker of all. Oh, dang! This is why Kite always runner up in life. What? No one can take serious with what? hopeless second best attitude. Oh my god, Riku, he suffered enough! Shut it, Riku. You, you really know how to hit a man when he's down, don't you? Dude, noted, never upset Riku. He will. He will flame you like no tomorrow. Why are you back here anyhow? How'd you worm your way back into Zeon's favor? Meh. No worming performed. We don't need you here. I've had enough of seeing my friends die. Betray me. I can't deal with this dirt anymore. We feel just the same. Which is why we want to do as much as we possibly can to help. That's why we came back. Yeah. You're not fooling anybody. You need not believe them. But they will prove to be an asset. Thank you, Zeon. I think we're pretty skilled. We held our own against, you know, you for a considerable amount of time. Huh. So that's it. You're siding with them in the end. You choose Noah over your own lieutenant. Again. Oh, man, Kite, don't do anything stupid. That's not what I'm saying. Don't you realize how hard I'm trying here? Ugh! Spot this! Oh, no. He's gonna get himself killed. What the dump? What do you want this? Sorry. 
I didn't mean to complicate matters. Oh god, our first day back. We're really not... Yeah, our reputation. <laughs> it could get worse. On the contrary, was this not your intent? I would have thought you'd be gloating by now. Dude, you got the wrong idea. Apparently we were not buddies after all. You don't even know me, bro. We can gloat if it makes you feel better. <laughs> but you can't just judge someone in the heat of the moment. Whatever you might think, suspicion will be cast upon you. That is all I can say. Suspicious or not, isn't it about time you tell us this plan of yours? You said we'd prove to be an asset. I'll continue. Though we have a geographical advantage, our provisions and numbers are limited. That's what the enemy will be banking on. And that's where you come in, as the vanguard. Our sudden appearance will put a spanner in their works, and that'll give you the edge you need, right? Seeing Keves and Agnes Bods fighting together and tearing up their front lines gonna throw them off their game for sure. So we've got to fight independently then. Better than being on a leash, I suppose. You seem to misunderstand. I'm not cutting you loose. You are still being regarded as traitors. Keep in mind that I shall be supervising your every action personally. Mm, this sounds like some <laughs> Metroid Other M. I authorize you to use this art, Noah. Oh, gee, thanks, Yon. Sir, yes, sir, Commander, sir. <laughs> Do you have to? He's <laughs> got. This is so goofy. Let it go, guys. Just, you know, we got to pay back our debt somehow, even if it sucks for the time being. I'll send details of the operation to your iris. The plan will commence at once. We're on it. But man, we still got to like, fight the Agnians? Can we like, hold back a little bit? I don't... Mm, what would you guys do in this situation? I still feel kind of... Dang, I still got it. I still got it. I still know my way around this colony. From the sounds of things, we just we just we're just like bait on a hook for them. Mince meat. And we're doing this all just to repay the debt of like us leaving. Which wasn't even our fault. I'd argue we don't owe them anything. I know it's kind of goofy, right? To be like, well, if I had the cat GF and could turn into Ouroboros, I'd do that. But like, legit. How much how much does like owing somebody a favor go? But truly, how much would you sacrifice to help out these people? I don't know. You can't just be like, well, those are different. Like, they're not that type of people, man. At the end of the day, I think that's what this, like, quest is trying to uh, convey to us. That, that is the most realistic ouch. <laughs> I can't help but laugh, but that ow is so realistic. The dump. Also, where are we? Uh, I guess just random area we never explored before. Uh, wait, this whole area mapped out? We've definitely been... Oh, this is like the start of the game, I think. Okay, sure. Maybe this is an Agnian uh, force that's you know upset over the battle in the beginning of the game. Trying to get vengeance. I phrase it like upset, like they're bummed out. I mean, naturally. We'll be arriving presently. Uni? You okay? Just feeling wistful. This is where we went looking for fortune clovers, isn't it? Oh yeah! You really made a big deal out of that. Did not. Just wanted to wish upon one. All the others laughed in my face. Said I'd never find one here. Everyone but you guys and Zeon. You must remember. Dang, trying to guild trip him. Come on, Zion. You used to be buddies. You remember? You're not the kind of guy who makes fun of people when they're trying their hardest. You help people in need. <sighs> Listen, I know you've been through all sorts of crap, but you don't know the whole story. Oh, I'm sure. There is no such thing as a traitor who rebels without cause. Please. Kevis, Wagnus. So you do understand. <sighs> You've sent many of my comrades off. No. Time and time again, you saved the dead. Help survivors. Even me. I know you do not make light of people's lives. So you understand? I do. But I can never be the friend to you that I once was. You don't give a set tree, do you? I wasn't talking to you, Lance. Excuse me? 
Maybe we can't go back to the old days. But we can build something new. Leave your platitudes for after. The battlefield awaits. Don't worry. We'll win. No one's dying on our watch. Never again. Time to move. Stay sharp. What the heck are these hero quests, bro? Valdi's and now this? This is just... Oh my god. This... This... You're, you're tearing me apart. Like, oh man, we used to be buddies. You know, we can still go back to that. And Zio's just like, no, no, we can't. We really can't, guys. We really can't. Times are different. But at the same time, I know you guys want to backstab us for no good reason. Oh, uh, my heart, dude. What the... Oh, well, yep, no one has to die anymore except these people we're about to go kill. Ha, 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 ha. There's a lot of them. This will be a battle of attrition. We can use the terrain for defensive advantage. First, we need to hurt their morale. Before that, we need to talk. I'll remain here and fight for as long as I stand. That's also part of the plan. Homie, you, yeah, you can hold him up for like 37 minutes, but... What about after that? At 38, you just collapse, like... It will be a grueling fight. I won't have time to be looking out for possible deserters. Hold on. Are you telling us to find a chance to escape? But... Then, what about the colony? I never said that. That is definitely not on record. I never even implied that. I have no idea what you mean, but I mean... Yes. <laughs> but this battle should be of little importance to you. Sparks shake, Zeon. Just how rotten do you think we are? <laughs> I see where you're coming from. But we're fighting on our own terms. We'll be seeing this through. We owe a debt to Colony 9. Maybe it wasn't for very long, but it gave us somewhere to belong. But not anymore. Just shut it, you! How hard is it for you to accept someone just wants to do a good deed? Hey? Eh? Get a clue! Whoa! Whoa, whoa, hold up! No! Lance! How often does he need telling not to abandon himself to his feelings? <laughs> it's harder for some people. It's. Have you given in? <laughs> Still, might as well strike while the iron's hot. All right. Also, Lance rushing in as the healer is kind of funny. <laughs> Come on, I heal all of you. Oh God. I don't know what resolution we have, but here we go. Wait, one out of fifteen. Holy dump! How long? Yeah, War of Attrition is right, bro. Holy dump! We're gonna sit here for hours. Before we end the battle, that's I'm not even kidding. Like these fights take like twenty five minutes, bro. There's, there's 15 of them. You you do the math. Let's check out uh, Deflector Form with our new buddy. Well, I guess not really our new buddy. So, adds 15 TP upon reactivation. What? I don't know. I, I, how do you reactivate a thing? I don't... Uh, okay. Let's see this attack of his? I mean... He's... Huh? Yeah, that's it. That... that what the dumb? Why do the heroes ones kind of suck? Like, you, you know what I, you know what I mean, right? Maybe it's my fault. Maybe I'm just used to the level three attacks of Xeno two. You know, and those are really flashy. In this game, though, eh? There, yeah. And there's only so many ways you can attack with a shield and sword, but. Oh, I get it. The reactivation thing is there. So if he come, if you can make him come back like that. Yeah, it, it, his new thing gets 50. Okay, that's decent. A hundred years later. What the spark of Ouroboros doing here? I did not sign up for this. Want us to run him down? We aren't here to kill each other. Pull back now, and we won't pursue you. Yeah, don't mess with Connie 9, bro. We got some freaks. We got some freaks on a lease, bro. I'll bet you won't. Because you'll be dead. Huh? Oh my god. They have air troop. Lemnesis. Always keep your ace in reserve. That's how the game's played. This guy's voice is so goofy. I'm gonna kill every single one of you. Uh, <laughs> that's not nice. Don't falter. We have Kite and the others holding the fort. Woohoo, Kite, the guy we publicly humiliated. Yeah, he's he's ready to fight for sure. Yeah. And we'll hold the line here. Whatever it takes. 
Wait. I gotta fight this guy? Dude, I was just making fun of? Oh, and the giant robot. Okay, that, yeah, yeah, that, 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 that makes some sense. Uh, here we go. All right, you wanna go? Dude with kind of silly voice, sure. Johnny, you really can't talk. Yeah, I, I know I can't, but like, that's all he is at the end of the day. Even if he does have a, oh crap, that's actually doing some damage. Uh, let's focus this thing down first. Oh God, oh man, if only we had Baldi here, bro. He'd be tearing this thing up, but then again, we, oh, we don't even need him. My God, our damage is actually kind of nuts. At least on, no one really can just do no wrong. Oh my God, this was even easier than the last battle. What the? Okay, I guess. <laughs> he sure talked big. <coughs> I'm done. Squad lead has been hit. Are you just the unit of silly voices? Like... Pull back. Uh, all right, yeah. We spared him. Why aren't you following them? I told you, I don't want needless slaughter. You're soft, rookie commander. Let me tell you something. You don't win wars while keeping your hands clean. You're gonna learn that the hard way. You'll see. Uh, oh no. He, he died? I guess we will. Don't let it get to you. I wouldn't normally, but in this instance, I'm afraid he struck a chord. I believe I said something similar to you in the past. We were sparring with training swords. You won in the end. I did. Because you always held back. That's not true. <laughs> you hated the very idea of fighting. That's how it seemed to me. And back then, I thought you'd never survive with that lofty idea. I was blind. If we don't stand for something greater, strife and conflict will grow ever fiercer. We would end up fighting not for the flame clock, but for our own bloodlust. That is who we are. It was never going to be easy. Yeah. I'm still trying to figure out what's right myself. But there's something I want to change. And to do that, I have to change myself. <laughs> Man, I'm actually tearing up, bro. This music, this acting, what the heck? <laughs> Why? The kites and the others pull through, okay? It seems we've averted disaster. For now. Heck yeah, go kite! Let's go! <laughs> it's a happy ending. Not quite. There's still unfinished business. Zion, I want you to understand the things we've seen. The truth about the flame clocks. Just let us explain. After that, we'll let you have the final say. As you wish. It also saves us an awkward silence on the way back. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> but don't get your hopes up. That's fine. Thank you. So basically, I have this infinity sword? I'll and... round up everyone in the square. Okay. But first, to Colony 9. Man, that was just that was just almost like a perfect moment. Other than the actual like fight being kind of mid, but like other than that, you know they can't you know can't have the most engaging boss fight every ep episode, right? Oh come on, we actually have to have an awkward walk back. That wasn't just for the cutscene. Uh, okay, one second. Muses are quite striking. Do they really grow from my head? Uh, uh, I can tell I'm being watched. He must be very weary of me. Oh gosh, Mio's got some fans. <laughs> Yo. What's good? You doing alright? You're still alive? Oh dump! Oh dump! Oh dump! Uh I guess he's in town. Whoever he is. Our heroes return. <laughs> I'm not scared. He's a twerp. Good like work, Zion. All the others. Where have you been? Just watching from the sidelines. And I must say, it was quite a spectacle. In what way? Bed pardon. I forget. You drones have no aesthetic sense. Your droll skirmish was one thing. It almost put me to sleep. But this here... Well, I'd say the colony is due a promotion. Oh, no. I recall no droll skirmish. 
The one where these maggots surfaced. Loads of little worms plotting together with Agnes, then deserting their duty like the cowards they are. Truly disgusting. A disgrace to the colony. And that goes for the ones who croaked for nothing, too. Even calling that droll is a disservice to the word. Croaked for nothing? I know you see us as enemies. But this, it's our friends you're talking about. Even Wamba. Back then, how dare you! Silence, maggots! What are you gonna do about it? You Bring it! They'll be tired from fighting. Rejoice then! You will give me great pleasure as I crush you. Oh no, we're, we're too weak. What's gonna. Oh, what the heck? Yo! Yes! Zeon's like, now my husband! This is my friends! I don't care if they betrayed me! So I made fun of your special attack earlier. <laughs> hey man, tanks can only do so much. You guys don't feel good about this either, do you? I mean, he, they what probably hate him. What do you think him. you're doing? The words of an idle man who orders others around. Or the words of rebels who risk their lives for us. Which do you think is worth more? Tell him. Don't he's got the same attack! Uh, well, what if it is? Oh, crud. Why is he gonna fight with- Why is this cutscene so cool? What the dog? He's actually risking it all for his whole colony, bro. He's just like, no, this is screwed up, man. Sacrifice yourself, I swear to God. Well, stupid maggot. Where did he? Don't you realize? <laughs> Wait, what? It's right in front of him. Oh my God! The maggot that feasts on our dead. That would be you. Did it straight in his face? Did not give a crud. Console's just like, well, crud. I better take my shoes and go somewhere else. <laughs> you seek death, then, Zeon. We want to live. That is why we fight. Yeah, we think you should go. Just saying. The old maggot talk, not really cool. Oh my god. Yes! Finally! Rebellion! Rise up! You're our number, punk. Hey, we hungry, but we're hungry Prepare for a fight. Yourself. <laughs> Console B! Why, you? He's good for nothing, imbecile! Oh my god. He's a pig type. Wait, what is All that? All defectors must be eradicated! Zeon! Yes. Let's go! I did not expect this. What the dump? This hero quest is like... Deluxe! It gets its own... Mobius for man. Are, are they gonna have him for the whole alphabet? At that point, they're kind of gonna lose their luster. <laughs> I mean, I'm not complaining, but if they keep looking cool, it looks like he has a uh, god. What were the weapons in Xenoblade X? He had the oh my god, no, he stops our healing completely. Oh, it didn't hit everybody. No, it just hit our healers. Man, that's effed up. Well, your, your class literally just does not exist anymore. Sandy, you gotta relax. Don't you got pray. I need a is there a way to have fusion first always on? I don't know. Wait, do we have to attack these? No, they're just straight up out of the fight. What a turd, bro. Cancel that. Into that. I mean, that's decent damage, but... Tyon can't actually... You know. Oh, God. You know, Zeon, we really need your tank ability. Oh, God dang it. I should have changed their two classes. Oh, well. Power hold. What is that? Did he just... He just picked some... Just pick Zeon up, bro. That is massive disrespect. F off, bro. I should probably switch to Senna real quick. Oh, God. No, she's effing dead. Okay, that's really bad. Cover them, cover them. Please, please, please. We have chain attack. Oh, wow, we got chain attack really fast. Like, that's like record speed. If I can just cross impact to activate. 
It would be the best time to do it. I really want to get story yet. Oh my god. Mobius Dominion healers again. This is... This is brutal. I guess actually, in a way, it's sort of genius to emphasize why tanks are so important. But at the same time, the support classes, they kind of complement each other, bro. I don't... I, I, just losing half of our party temporarily is kind of messed up. I'm not a fan. We are almost level three on uh, Noah's inner link though. Yes, yes, get him, launch him. Come on. Oh wait, no, we did the daze. Who does, who has daze arts? Oh, whatever. <laughs> it was still damaged. What am I complaining about? Got Chris, cross impact. Who's, what is Chris impact? Does more damage to Chris's? I don't that has to be like a best in slaw art because it's really like low, like, it's not a laggy animation. And also the like power of power charge. I imagine it's only going to get better and better as we continue with the game. God, I love this battle system. I love this hero quest. I love almost everything about this game. To be told, there isn't much I dislike. Uh, can I get this? No, I'm not fast enough. Darn. He's going for Blaze Party? Okay, I guess he just kind of shoots out of his fingertips. I guess my only real criticism right now is that, yeah, the HP scaling on some of the enemies. Like, man, these fights! They go on for a while, but that might just because, be because I don't really know how to use like all the combat options that our party has. I feel like I'm doing things at least somewhat optimally, right? But with our Ouroboros in their current state, you know, like maybe there are some optimizations I'm missing out on. And then yes, I do know I'm sitting on the chain attack and could probably do like 25% of his HP in a single hit, but oh, come on, where's the fun in that? You gotta like see some of his moves, right? All right, let's cancel this. He's almost at half. Wait, no, he cancel. There we go. Woo! Oh no, I was too too slow. Darn it. Okay, he's at half. Any new moves at the start? No. It's just still kind of sitting there. Blast wave. Okay. Oh, that did like huge AOE. Oh, well, we got two healers. Uh, right? We got two healers that are. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Full healers. Atomic cannon. Is he finally gonna shoot those things? Yes, dude. It is the things. Well, we got our own atomic cannons. Okay, that is cool. Man, I really hope... I don't know. It'd be kind of lame, but I hope there is a way to, like, refight the Mobius models, like, in the late game. You know, some, like, final gauntlet in, like, space or something. Just so we can see these models again. Because they are hyper impressive. Even if this is just, you know, one of the other consoles with a new weapon. No. No, put him down. Put him down, you freak! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh god, he got one shot. No, this is awful. Okay, once Mio gets out of her uh, bindings, we can probably go for Ouroboros level three. No, he still can't because that when she just got bound again and killed. Okay, this sucks. We might actually lose. God dang it. Okay, this is getting really bad. Oh my god. I got greedy, dude. I should have... Okay, I gotta save her. I should have used chain attack when I had the chance. Dump! I screwed up! Him binding the healers and just straight up one-shotting the tank is not cool. Hot tank! When you kill all my friends instantly, it's really a bummer. Let's hope maybe this mega spinning edge can just save the day. It's gonna come in clutch! Come on! Come on! Big damage! Please! No, that wasn't enough! Oh my god, we're effing dead once we fall out of this. Uh, YOLO chain attack! With like, three people! <laughs> this is bad! Um, Hail Mary play, let's go! Okay, Noah, big hit! Uh, not big enough! Oh god! <laughs> Why'd I turn into Krusty the Clown? Okay, Wind Slash, just for a little bit of healing. If we get one more, okay, yes, yes, this will continue. Perfect. Please, Noah, please. We need the bravest of brave assaults. I'm talking. I'm talking what? Walking into Bed Bath & Beyond with... Uh, a beaver? Wait, what, what does that mean? I don't even know what I'm saying. It doesn't matter. It was really clutch when we pulled it off. It's futile, you know. You won't change anything. You think you have a future? Well, you don't. Only suffering and despair.
Even so, the choice is mine. Lay things out for me here, Commander. Our console's a monster. Our flame clock's busted. We still don't have enough food to go round. I have to ask, what was the point of all this? We succeeded, though not quite the way I'd hoped. Now then, listen. So basically our entire lives up till now have been a lie, and yeah. You, you can't be serious. Then what? It was all a sham. So it would appear. For that reason, we need to learn as much as we can about ourselves and about the world outside. Oh, is that everything? And while eating shoe leather? If need be, whatever the outcome may be, only we can change it. I believe that. We'll help you out too. Not because we're looking for your acceptance, but just so everyone can live. So please, let us further your goal. I know you still have doubts, but won't you give them a chance? Might as well, right? Can't get worse. <laughs> I confess, I'm still a bit dazed by these developments, but I could let them off. Yeah, same. The Commander's never quite been this insistent. If Mwamba were here, I think he'd have agreed much sooner. Are you kidding? Friends. Well, I'm still not buying it. Oh, man, come on. The one to make the call should be me. I should decide. Nobody else. I'll prove it. The only one fit to be commander is me. We're gone. Uh. Okay. Well, what the hell? Ah. Man, way to go off on one. Kite, he just worries for the colony. He will come round eventually. So, what's the word now, boss? First, I want to solve the food shortage. What, you mean by taking long hikes? It'll be tough without anything nearby. That was the case up until now. Myself? I'll try it the other way. Mm. What way? What do you mean? We'll make fields. Oh. Our own food supply. Grown with our own hands. He's a farmer. When he says fields, does he mean like that bit in the textbook? When food is scarce, one may till the soil and plant glitter radishes. You always know your stuff. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> I'm the studying type. I see. Thought it was obvious. It was difficult to find time before, since you had to worry about the flame clock. Yes, but not any longer. <laughs> you giving it a go then? There will be toil, but we'll try. Then start by observing the vegetation. It's not just soldiers that want to survive out here. You're sure to learn something. I understand. We'll try that. Oh, and if you're ever in need of my support, just call on me. That's what I'm waiting to hear. Heck yeah. That's appreciated, but are you really sure? If you truly want to change something, you must start with the self. I believe you said that. Oh, did I? I say a lot of things. Still, some folks aren't gonna like you when you're panning around with us lot. It doesn't matter what they think of me. What truly matters is whether I carry out my duty. Zeon, you haven't changed at all. Sarcasm? At this stage? Not at all. I was just thinking that you're still the same old friend from back then. You've gained away with words. I see. Perhaps people can change. Wow, ouch. <laughs> you gave us strength. 
Thank you. Thank you. This almost turned out too perfect. Like, I mean, except with Kai, yeah, but like, everything else. Zeon going from some paladin on the battlefield, protecting his allies to, you know what? I could go for some juicy broccoli. That's, I love this game, bro. That was an effing movie. That, maybe it's just his aesthetic, but man, I feel like I'm gonna like this class, bro. N another one for Noah? Dang, he's popular. All right, Zeon's class, Guardian Commander. Okay, it's kind of a mouthful. I'll call it Guardian. Great at protecting allies. About to be in content. Didn't, didn't you get flung around like a beanie baby in that last freaking battle? Uh, all right, their talent art absorbs attacks to gain extra power. Sounds way effing better than Mad Taunt. Shoot, let's let's update, bro. A defender whose skills shine even brighter in the face of adversity. A ray of hope on the field of battle. F yeah. Yo, I didn't realize, but yeah, heroes actually level up independently. That's kind of a pain. I hope there's some like diminishing returns aspect. Because I mean, I like Voldy. I want to keep using Voldy, but you can only have one at a time. As for our new team composition, uh, man, everyone is kind of maxed with the starter classes. Maybe, hmm, who's our old, 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 old tank? Like I'm talking, I'm talking ancient. That had to be Mio. She was our dodge tank. And she sadly doesn't have this class yet. Oh my God, these shoulder pads, no. It was perfect. It had the stalwart appearance of a paladin. And but, but we got, ah, uh, uh, why? Eh, it looks good on the dudes, I guess. Anyway, I, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some theory crafting with the new uh, classes and I'll see you guys next episode. Truth be told, I wanted to knock out more uh, side quests and I'm probably gonna do that next time and then resume our main quests. But God, that hero quest. Fuck it. If they're all this good, I don't know what I'm gonna do. This is, this is probably just, was just Trump one and two easily. But yeah, if you guys have any uh, class like suggestions and stuff, I'd also love to hear that. Uh, literally everyone on, on planet Earth is farther in this game than me. Day. Please don't start. Stop it. We started the episode. We're not doing that again. F you. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed me fangirling over Zeon and Noah's bromance. So I, uh, I feel like that's that's going to continue. See you guys next time for more Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Bye.